It's been 22 years since the disappearance of Michelle Harris, and after four trials against her estranged husband, attorneys are heading back to court to try and clear his name. It took up literally um, 15 years of his life. The entire breath of his children being raised was under the um, false allegation that he murdered their mother. Cal Harris was convicted two times for the murder of his former wife, Michelle Harris, in 2001. The two married in 1990 and had four kids together that they raised on their rural Spencer estate. Those verdicts convicting Cal were ultimately overturned, and in 2016, he was acquitted of the crime. Now Harris is heading back to the courtroom, but this time he isn't the defendant. The core allegation here is that we allege a conspiracy to violate Cal Harris's civil rights. The defendants literally conspired to violate his civil rights uh, by fabricating um, evidence and by uh, coaching witnesses to commit perjury. Bruce Barquett is representing Cal Harris in a civil rights lawsuit against Tioga County officials, New York State Police, and witnesses in the trial that convicted Harris of murder. In March, a judge ruled that the case would move forward in front of a jury, with a scheduled date of November 6. But recent court filings show the defendants want to move the date and also appealed the ruling. We're looking forward to uh, closing the last chapter in this awful uh, event or events or ordeal that Cal and his children have had to gone through. In Tioga County, Grant Johnson, 12 News.